popular social media post claims that during a meeting with India's Minister of External Affairs, S. J. Shankar, U.S. Secretary of State, Antony Blinken, cited statistics of minority persecution in India under the current BJP rule. Blinken is quoted as having questioned Jay Shankar on why many Indian Hindus migrate to the USA and why Jay Shankar himself studied in a Christian college, among other things. We found that a similar post has been viral since April 2022, after a joint press conference held by top Indian and US ministers on 11th April 2022 at Washington, D.C. In this conference, talking about India-US relations, Blinken said, We also share a commitment to our democratic values, such as protecting human rights. We regularly engage with our Indian partners on these shared values and to that end, we are monitoring some recent concerning developments in India, including a rise in human rights abuses by some government, police and prison officials. Following this, on 14th April 2022, Jayshankar said, People are entitled to have views about us, but we are also equally entitled to have views about their views and about the interests and the lobbies and the vote banks which drive that. So whenever there is a discussion, I can tell you that we will not be reticent about speaking out. Adding that the human rights issue was not a topic of discussion during the ministerial meeting. In June 2022, during the release of the International Religious Freedom Report 2021, Blinken said, In India, the world's largest democracy and home to a great diversity of faiths, we've seen rising attacks on people and places of worship. The Ministry of External Affairs responded with a statement calling the comments ill-informed. So, though Blinken said the US is concerned about the recent rise in human rights violations in India, as he never made the kind of statements shared in the viral forward, this post is misleading. When you come across a piece of news that seems too ridiculous to be true, don't leave things to doubt. Run searches on Google and Yandex and weigh out the true and false of the situation for yourself by looking at the facts. But first of all, before you hit that forward button, pause.